to succeed, you only need to train your memory. Anyone who can read and write can improve the efficiency of their memory. The popcorn rules consist of a list I made up several years ago stating some natural memory methods you can use immediately. They are called the popcorn rules because you can remember the rules easily by the word. Each letter of the po word popcorn represents a rule. Here they are. Number one, positive attitude. If you have an enthusiastic attitude toward remembering, your natural memory will eat up your material and you can improve your natural memory by 5 to 10 percent. If you wonder how to become positive, a simple way is to examine your goals. Number two, observation. Did you ever go to the big city or country town to see how people walk? They walk in a straight line with their heads down, ignoring what is going on all around them. To have a better natural memory, you must take notice of your surroundings. When you do this, your natural memory improves automatically. Number three, picture it. With this idea, you come closer to the heart of the memory methods that we have discussed in our class. It is called the mind's eye. Is there a third eye? In a matter of speaking, yes. For example, do not think of the Empire State Building. What is happening? Yes, you are thinking in the picture form of a piece of the building the whole structure, or some kind of image of the Empire State Building. Your mind's eye is like a video picturing device in your mind that can help your natural memory. So the next time you want to remember something, picture it. Actually see that telephone number or Aaron in that third eye. Number four, concentration. If you have paid close attention to the previous hints, you have been concentrating. It is difficult to tell someone to concentrate on one single task, but concentration is connected with natural memory. You will find that your concentration level will be higher when you use the popcorn rules and the memory systems, which we will continue to discuss in this class. Number five, organization. If you organize the facts that you have to remember, you will retain them longer. There was a study some years ago in a group. Group A and Group B had to remember 16 household items in a given set of time. The group, which was given the items in an organized fashion, remembered the items faster and retained the list longer. If you want that type of improvement, get organized. Number six, review it aloud. The way to properly review is to use your vocal cords and actually say aloud the material you want to remember. Studies have proven that using your vocal cords stimulates natural memory, but never review this way while walking down the street. Number seven, natural associations. When faced with a memory obstacle that reminds you of something in your past, use that image. This will lock it in your memory because it is from a personal experience. For example, say you have to remember the number 747-1939. First, examine the number. The number 747 reminds most people of a plane, so use that image. Actually see that plane in your mind's eye. Next, look at 1939. That number may remind people of the New York World's Fair or their old address. It does not make any difference as long as you see that picture. With this simple rule, you can see an improvement in your memory immediately. And these are the rules of all natural memory methods. P for positive attitude, O for observation, P for picture it, C for concentration, O for organization, R for review it aloud, and N for natural associations.